All right, here we are, live yep, from so SneakerCon. Recording live. Uh, as you can tell, we're not smoking in, well, we kind of are. Falcor's back there, he's smoking. Slowly. Yeah, he's oh, hey. You know. Man, you I'm know. jealous, okay, whoa, 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 whoa. There's still yeah, clouds yeah. over here, you know. Yeah, I blame it on Falcor. Uh, yeah, man, the Luck Dragon is in our favor today. Have we even talked about that since uh, we showed it at Decon? What, dragons? Did we, did we talk about the Falcor? We talk, uh, sure, it wasn't like I, I didn't do it an elaborate thing. You just saw visuals of it. We didn't get the whole explanation. Word. Yeah. Well, which I have on tape multiple times. We'll just do like a snippet word. for the, word. Uh, for the people Well, for those there. of you that don't know, that's mass number 200 back there. Falcor from Never Any Story. Made out of Super Bowl Trainer 1s. Uh, some Doc Martens 3D parts, LCD animated eyes, and of course a smoke machine built into the nostrils. Uh, but I'll tell you more about that another time, just so you know what you're looking at back there. But uh, we got a we got a cool episode in store for him today. Since we're at SneakerCon, surrounded by the hype of the hype, figured we might as well go for a uh, best of 2019. And I would say uh, our predictions are, are pretty much on point. What, the best of? Best of 2019, yeah. yeah. Well, what we, we just start with what we're seeing here. The Travis Scott sixes are everywhere. everywhere. But, I mean, that doesn't really surprise me because when they dropped on Sneakers app, I saw a lot of Ws. I saw more Ws than Ls. And I I'm didn't not... think about that, actually, the how many people got them yeah but now we're, you get the visual of now it right get, here now dude, you get to visualize that everyone shit. has them on dude. and i'm not mad at it i wore mine yesterday i, I just love that fucking shoe no it, it's my favorite easily of the tr of the travis I mean, scott we're collabs. already talking about it why don't i just go ahead and pull it up because what we're talking about right now are the best collabs of 2019 and this is pretty high on my list like i dig Travis Scott's music. I've been digging his collabs. He's been doing good work. This isn't something that I got because I'm a fan of Travis Scott or the hype, obviously. Uh, but yeah, we've talked about it and shown it. It's the olive yeah. and infrared. The glow in our soul seals the deal. But like, this hits so many marks on my collections, right? Because it's the olive and infrared collection. But it is a, still a rapper collab. And because I'm into sneakers, because I'm into hip hop. Yeah. I have a lot of rapper collabs in my collection, totally. so and still more to fucking go after. Like that, those are some of my favorite shit. That's What's, where what one you don't me. have that you really want. Yo, well, fucking those purple tapes that I bought that oh, seller never man. shipped. Dude, I, we did I, that I didn't get burnt. Yeah, episode. I didn't get burnt, but now there's no size 11 Diodora purple tapes. That's that's top of my list right now. Uh, there's definitely a few more pairs of the Pusha T's. I just saw those uh, Pusha T as we goes on sale during Black Friday, or maybe it was the week after. But like, not bad, man. Yeah, not bad. Like, especially at a discount, I might pick those up just to ha just to add to the rotation, man. What now, we got? right now we're talking about what we had on foot yesterday, but you had one of our best collabs of 2019 That's on right. foot yesterday as well which were the uh bodega no bad days no bad days this is now i will say that they made it onto our top 
uh, collabs of 2019 twice with their No Bad Days and No Days Off. No Days Off. Uh, I think I actually prefer the No Days Off. I mean, I have these ones and I'm really? very, very happy with these, but the darker and hairier suede, yeah, yeah. The darker mesh on the, no on, the, on the tongue and the hairier or on the, on the suede, no days I off. really like these ones. And the purple on the, t the back tab, like, I, this is really sets off for that, me. That actually surprises me because I would give it to no bad days. That's the pair that I would. Well, I'm happy pick to up. have them. Yeah, yeah I, you know. I am happy to have them. Uh, I'm happy to see them. I got all a lot of comments on them yesterday. I wasn't expecting that. Uh, right. I saw a couple of them for sale out there. I didn't see anybody else wearing them, so that's always a. What were they selling for? 450 at least. Okay. I've seen okay. them for a higher, I think. Yeah, yeah and they were that's, smaller sizes. That's fairly respectable. Smaller yeah, sizes. I don't know. What, Most what? shit's pretty small size that I've seen. I mean, they would look good in small sizes too, though. Yeah, yeah. This is definitely a, yeah, a, mine's good, a 12. good shoe it's for that. A and large it still looks sharp. Yeah. So. Man, that's like what we got on today. Like, okay, okay, let's talk about. I'm doing this, bro. My man. Right, who wins here? Just put him up right there. When our souls combine. Yeah. Okay, so I'm wearing the Air Max Plus 3 today. Yeah, fuck you I for that. Be, you got two pairs of that, didn't it. you? Yeah. Uh, two pairs already. I will get more if they go on sale. I Which need I'm to get a pair. To sleep on ASAP. Yeah, show off this right, air right. bubble. Hold on, hold on. Let me put my fingers no, all up in this air bubble. Too. Inside. Oh, there inside you go. Board. Little yeah. burst of bubbles across there. Along with those sharp lines, man. Like... This is a fucking beast Dude, and then ass show. Show them the smallest mini ever. Have, right? All right. Oh. Just, just use your handheld. Ouch. Yeah, that little tiny, tiny swoosh is everything in here right now. Oh, okay. I'm busted. And that colorway is fucking fire. Did I believe these are on our uh, best uh, best of 2019 as well. I don't even know if we listed them in the collabs. Uh, I think it would end up on that list. So when you see these later, just remember we had a slide for them for this part. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, these are amazing. You can't go wrong with these. These have been on foot, so they're a little cloudy, though. If you want to be real, I got I got little sweat bubbles in there. <laughs> That's real shit. Now, is it really sweat or is it condensation that forms from the outside in? Is outside something I've been in? No, about. like it's your sweat? shoe is the, or your foot is what's putting the moisture it, it, heat, into and the. And cold on the outside, it causes condensation. Then the then the condensation would be on the outside. The okay, moisture like is on like the a, inside, and the only no, way but the it's moisture. Hot on the inside, cold on the outside. Can get off of me? No, 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 wait, 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 wait. We're going to spend way too much time talking about sweat on about your the, shoes the right now. the science of it, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, get off of me. I'm going to take this thing. That's sweat equity, Dano, just for the record. Sweat equity? That's yeah, disgusting. Yeah, that's what that is. Yeah. All right, let's uh, go to the slideshow. show. All right, there we go. Should I, should I show them what I was drawing yesterday? Speaking yeah, yeah, of the yeah, Travis Scott Sixes. Sick. It's not finished yet. I still got some more work to do to it, but I'm not sure got a little like illustration you time. You know, Noel was a damn good illustrator in his he own. Yes, yes, yeah. He's he gonna push a little bit even harder at my now. speed, yeah. but like he was teaching me about some comic book shit last night. Yeah, I Look, appreciate the the interesting things that he knows more about I, than I, I do. Love, I love that Nolan is surprising all y'all, but I got a good read on motherfuckers, and I would not hire or. I don't, I don't think you need to defend yourself. No you don't need you know to defend what I mean? yourself. I'm not. I'm defending my man's in them. Like, yeah, he doesn't need defense. Look how tall he is. Look yeah. how tall yeah, he is. Yeah, yeah. You should see his jumper too. Yeah. 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 You, you got can. all excited you now. Can, you can yeah. check out his jumper on my IG yeah. story right now. Oh no, wait. They can't because this is airing Wednesday and my story ain't gonna be up. Maybe, maybe I'll make a little Nolan. Uh, IG story fucking, what's the joint that when they save to the profile? 
What? I can't even think of it. The IG to the when profile. You, when you save your IG to a your highlight, profile. There you go. A highlight. A highlight. Yeah, I'll, shout I'll out to IG. A, a Nolan yeah. highlight, and every time he does something good, he'll get a new uh, highlight in there. Uh, okay, so we kind of want to do a year-end wrap-up style show, right? It's kind of what yeah, we're doing. We kind of we got, we got ahead of ourselves there. Bit, we'll, we'll reset here. Right now, we're yeah, we're going back to focusing on the best collabs of 2019. These are the, the collabs that drew our attention, drew the community's attention, or in some way just tell a good story and, and all of that. Um, all right, so you want to start with these undefeated let's fours? Start, yeah, all let's right. talk about these undefeated Kobe well, the four. the fours in general is, is wild that, like, they brought back the Kobe four, and it is every pro is wearing it. Maybe I And there's so many colors. Just copious amounts of weed that have slowed my comprehension skills. I don't think so. I think maybe I'm just a little bit slow. You don't but follow wait, the NBA like wait, I do. No. What I got to say is it took me too long to realize that Pro Tro was a pro retro yeah like they updated the tech I was like, in what, it what the fuck yeah. is pro tro well i'm not gonna at, sit here and act like i knew what that was you just told me what that was okay <laughs> yeah okay. a, that, pro, that, that, well, a professional that retro a pool. <laughs> yeah great thank you got it's the like, credentials like pro am <laughs> it's a pro tro pro tro uh, uh but they're everywhere and they've yeah. released so many more cool colors ways we were talking about this the other night uh, I had a pair of Carpe Diems, and then there there were a couple other cool colorways of them, but I feel yeah. like they, they it wasn't that much time spent into the colorways of the four, and now they At went back time. to it, and, and they're, they're doing just it going right. to town. And these undefeated it. joints are really dope. With that iridescent yeah. toe box and everything, I'm man. pretty sure I haven't got a pair of these. Yeah, I, I, yeah. I'm pretty certain I saw these. And I've seen a few pairs uh, around for sale at SneakerCon today. But never your size, man, because you need a 12, 11 and a half? A 12 of these, yes. 12. Of these, no, but I want the the other ones, the, like, San Antonio Spurs colorway. Oh, but what yeah. I'm saying is they had the whole pack on this shelf over there okay. for, like, a decent price. I've been really good this weekend. It wasn't the right I'm, size. I, you know, I'm, I'm doing my best to no, not buy anything. No, that's good, but, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I know I, you're I'm still trying to find the right color Air Force right? Ones, but I think Jin just bought those for me last night. Ah, uh, yeah. And I put it in her ear. I'm like, that'd be a good Christmas gift. Yeah, yeah, there you go. You got a, you got some Christmas gifts and coming up. And then she had up, me, so. like, log in the stock eggs for her. I'm, I think that went well for me. I don't know. God bless you, uh, Jen. You know what the man wants. But Undefeated always does good work. Of course. I mean, they're yeah, undefeated for I a reason. Think, like, I can't think of a cloud that they did where I'm like, oh, man, they really fucking oh, botched no, that definitely, one. Definitely. I'm, I'm starting to get a little maybe salty sour about this lack of Air Max 90 Undefeated release. You might where be. The, okay, you I are. am. Yeah. I'm a little bit beef jerky right now. All the way salted. Uh, <laughs> Bro. So I am salt cured. I'm salt yeah. cured, bro. <laughs> we don't even have a fridge. We just salt all our meat to preserve it. <laughs> uh, what about this uh, overshoe, though? Overshoe? Mars Yard. Uh, oh, dude, I looked out there. I'm like, dude, those are some Kobe 9s. What are oh. you talking about? <laughs> yeah. It's it's okay. By the way, it's it's hard to do this show. We we love shoes. There's so a much. lot of distractions. There's a lot of foot traffic around here, and that's a good way to put it. There's Yo, a lot of dope shit being out. worn, walking Sh around. I see Paranorman foams walking my way right now. That's pretty nice. With the fucking Supreme jacket, that's kind of a sick fit. The, yeah, that's that's the yeah. right way to do yeah. that. Yeah. That's the right way to do that. That's oh, how I'd style it if I ever got a chance to do the Paranorman mask. I was really trying. I was really trying when they did that is, weird photo nothing's contest. Nothing's over. Nothing's over. Nothing's over. Oh, of course. There's always a chance. Yo, but you're talking about what we saw, what we've seen on feet? Yes. Let's talk about that. I saw a fucking Warhawk 90s on foot yesterday. I saw a photo of them. I wasn't in the area where you oh, saw them. I fucking spotted them bitches walking down the fucking hall, and I was like, Kevin, bring bring him over. I need to talk to that man about his shoes. Like, And that's, what, that's, that's the good type of... Uh, interaction that that's what we're here for yeah, and absolutely to to run into like-minded heads and I have uh, had fun seeing friends sneakerhead friends exactly meet new ones real friends and exactly yeah it's been exactly. it's been fun in that sense I have had seen some other heat what else did we see on foot I saw a pair of red Octobers in the red MMW sole it was I, what are you I talking get, about oh no they were you were talking about that earlier wait were they the red 
Outsoles too? Yes. Because they did the like red a red one. Outsole yeah, yeah. MMW with red Octobers in it, and like I don't, I don't think it made either shoe look better, which you can do mixing shoes into the MMW. Um, but I'll give them originality. I did not expect to see that, and fucking a. That's that's something. Like I would rather. That, I'd no, rather see cra- more of flex. that. That's a flex that you it's like to see. It's definitely a hard flex, but at least it's an original no, flex. No, it's interesting flex. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Like, a lot of okay, boring bro. flexes out there. Yeah, yeah. plenty of, like, yeah, like you just oh, you got money. I mean, like, yo, like, someone's wearing their their Wahlburger Force today, and, like, yo, oh, that's, yeah, that's, I just saw, he just walked by again. I dope, talked to him for, like, 15 minutes pair. yesterday, dude. Yeah. He has a whole video of him buying those at the at another Seeker Con for, oh, like, 15 really? racks. Oh, shit. Yeah. That's that's a grip. Yeah. But he was saying, like, he'll have those, and then he'll move those on. He might make something, or you might lose a grand on them, and, like, you, right. you're you right. still going to get some wild shit out of that. He's about having the, those ones, not not like a, a ton of collection. You know what I mean? Like, have, I, I have that, that one crazy-ass I pair. Can, I can dig that. Like, I, I like that, but there's that's not me. Like I'm all about variety and mixing it up and like exactly. whatever I'm feeling that day. It's it's such a fun thing. My Whoa, God. was that a request? <laughs> no. Okay. But if it was a request, it would be just the orange skittles. Did he no, buy this kidding. from a movie theater from 1995? <laughs> what? Where is this from? What? We're gonna go see the Matrix yeah. and eat yeah. these skittles after <laughs> yeah. this. You got any? What are those? Snow peaks? Snow caps? <laughs> oh, yo. Sour patches. He's got nachos over here. No, is that hummus? Is that pita chips and hummus, Frankie? Oh, and couscous. It's so uh, the food's so, so nice, they named it twice, my man. Speaking um, of Pineapple Express quotes, uh, we're just going to eat these Skittles out of our hand and not out of a buckle. Uh, all right. Let's get back to the, what are these, overshoes? Yeah, the uh, Tom Sachs Mars Yard overshoe. I didn't see any other, like, whoa, I love that I saw those. You know what I mean? That I, I've kind of mentioned what I... You mean you that doesn't make you feel this way? You don't feel that way about these shoes? These shoes are, I like the Mars Yard. The, the, the I mean, original, yeah, the I can't, one I can't always act like I like everything. Right, right. Because these are just not something I would ever wear. I just don't see it happening. And now I see, see people wearing these, like, that rocket, like Rax Hogan. Oh, yeah. You know what I mean? Like someone who pulls this shit off because he's so wild with his style. Now. I can't do that. I've seen a lot of customizers, and I've actually done a pair myself for uh, our homeboy, Philip Zito, cutting the... Uh, who stopped by the booth yesterday? Yeah, yeah, saw him and actually was talking about maybe chopping up another pair of these for his homie. I might end up with the uh, that outer shell to make a mask out of. That could be cool, like really yeah. shroudy, something different. Yeah. Maybe uh, let it unravel a little bit. You know, <laughs> just don't I guess put it a, does look like it could just be don't pretty, put a point on the top big, of it. Right? That's all. Like when you when you open, they take those straps off and you open it up, it yeah. just goes straight down, like yeah, a fucking a, shopping sack. Good, yeah, it's a. It's a bag of potatoes. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, I like seeing these on foot. The undercover. Uh, why am I drawing a blank? Daybreaks. Yeah. They the have. Undercover always knocks it out of the park. I, I feel like this is probably some of my favorite work that I've seen from them. Their latest, like, I don't like the Air Max 720, but those latest ones are fucking wild. Agreed. You know what I mean? Agreed. But um, like, they really, they really did great with the the color blocking. Like, oh yeah. The yellow it's very ones? easy. I'm saying the yeah. yellow. I really, I don't even like navy blue shit, but the navy blue pair goes hard. Like, it's hard. It's easy to lose me. <laughs> Frankie is creepily eating his food, staring at Dano off camera. Yeah, right, just staring just so up you know, into space. Just staring off right <laughs> yeah. into space. Yeah, yeah. He's literally staring down this tunnel of his shoes. I've never seen anybody chew hummus so much. Yeah, it's already chewed up for you, bro. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm on Thursday. Frankie's ahead of time right <laughs> He's now. He's on Thursday. Uh, whatever what the fuck I was going to say means. about the undercovers uh, daybreaks is it's very easy to lose my attention with classic colors. Absolutely. Um, you and mean like primary? Pri- especially yeah, yeah, primary okay. colors, yeah. 
or or even like uh, athletic colorways, if you will, sure. like that, you know, the like maize and uh, university maybe. red exactly. and stuff like that. Yeah, yeah. Very easy to lose my attention. Uh, but these have maintained, and I love seeing them on foot. And now I'm kind of like, uh, I might I might look at a pair for myself. So oh, yeah, good, I can see you rocking good these drop for sure. Jason's got multiple pairs, and he looks great in them. He brought a yellow pair, and that's why I'm thinking about getting a pair. Yeah. I, I, I don't, like, this is a cool update on a classic. Like, they definitely super fuck with this thing. What, are you going to die in it, Skittle? No, I, I just missed my mouth. It'll happen. They updated a classic. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, my bad. Whoa, 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 whoa. whoa. <laughs> they updated a classic in a crazy way with that, like, super harsh angle. And it's, like, sharp on these, like, I got to make a mask that? out of that shit. Zoom in on that? Oh, for sure, dude. Yeah, that, that That'd heel be such a ridge. wild piece for you to use. Ding, 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 ding. Yeah, that thing's Little aggressive fucking, as shit. It's like a serrated blade right there. Uh, yo, the fucking uh, Kyrie rocks. 5 SpongeBob pack has got to be probably one of the best collabs of 2019. Again, something that, like, I'm not a SpongeBob fan. I'm not, not a fan. I'm just not my wheelhouse. Right, you don't consider yourself a SpongeBob fan. I don't consider but, myself one either. I like SpongeBob, but like right. I'm not like a holy shit. I knew that episode. Blah 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 happened. I'm like no. And, and I'm sure there's not. I'm sure there's not really a chance that someone would be like, you shouldn't be wearing those. You don't know about SpongeBob. I've been talking about that all week, and there's all these people wearing Friends shirts and sweatshirts, and, and, and I'm like. like you don't know shit about Friends. You don't know Chandler Bing You don't Ball. watch Friends. You, you don't, don't know, know the about name Chandler of their Ball. Ball. Yeah. You don't know the name of the duck. That's hilarious. It's just chicken and duck, but... Yeah. There you go, though. Um, but there was... I think we saw Liam May yesterday wearing a Friends hoodie, and I was like, all right. Like, I didn't question that mm -hmm. at all. Um, I can dig it. All right, but yeah, these SpongeBob Kyries, all the these Kyries are amazing in general. The fives I have, speaking of which, the Friends pair. Don't speak too those. much on it because we're gonna talk more later. Okay, okay, I'll shut the fuck up. A little spoiler SpongeBob alert. Collaborations were. But you ended I up with these, the, with these, right? And the Patricks are coming. The Patricks are on the yes. way. Okay. Please tell me you're gonna wear a mismatch. Yes, I, she's okay. so excited to see me wear a mismatch. Fuck yes. I do need us. I need something to really tie together. I don't want to just do all black and just that. I want to have a SpongeBob thing. I have a SpongeBob Gorilla Art Squadron design from Mass 365. Maybe like a chain detail, like a little Ooh, SpongeBob thing, like a just. A, but like, as nice as that would be, is that I the piece that you once. want? Yeah, I'd wear exactly. It with, I'd wear it with one outfit. Like, I'm not that guy yet. Not yet. Not yet. Pass Frankie the Skittles. Smart man. Pour more for us before you pass that. I know I'm I know I'm dealing with. No, no, no. no. Uh, these joints, man. Okay, yeah, so we got these the joints jump will on make these. You John, flex. John sent us these, like, a day before they went viral. And then right. we, so it was seeing them just from a text. It was like, what, what's going on here? You know what I mean? Like, you didn't have all the info that was released the next day about, mm -hmm. like, what it happened, you know, why th this happened, and, yeah. and that it was water from the fucking River Jordan, right, or some shit like that, which yeah. is like, is it really? Like, can we be serious? Because know. it looks awfully clean. Yeah, well, there's definitely a blue tint of something, at oh, least in the true. airbag or something. Look it's got to be the airbag, right? It looks like it's from, like, glacier water. That's definitely the bottle, yeah, not the water, Yeah, it looks like that bro. shit from Waterboy that he breaks yeah. out from his necklace at the end. Yeah. The glacier water? Eskimo water. Eskimo water. Well, look, the word, the word of the year has definitely been drip, and if you pop your airbag, you're going to be dripping. <laughs> look. That's great. I, for real, though. This is, a, this is a dope pair of Air Max. And like, oh, the, the whole concept and... How this isn't an official Nike release, correct? This is yes. a wild collab. Yes, yeah. wild collab. Yeah. Wild collab. All right. Next. Okay. Let's yeah. talk about these. The MCA off-white uh, Air Force Ones. Yeah, this is off-white stuff, so I'm kind of, like, bowing out. I know you like this color. You're, but you're the Air Force One guy. I like Air Force Ones, but I'm not an off-white guy. 
At all. None of them. All of it throws you off? Nothing. I've not seen a single pair of off-white things where I'm like, damn, I need that. Okay. And the whole aesthetic. Fair enough. The whole aesthetic just doesn't work for me. I am a little bit drawn into these because of actually just the collaboration. Not the Virgil part, no offense, yeah. but the MCA part. Yeah. Like, anything art-related and sneakers yeah. I want a little piece of. But this color is so not me. Oh my god, right? Like I don't I don't know that you'll ever see me in baby blue. Um that silver swoosh is, is nice, you know? Like I've seen I've seen actually I saw somebody at Designer Con wearing these and I was like, yo, that's I've a good bunch look for of you, here. bro. Yeah. You know, but I've seen a bunch of these here and it wasn't a good look for whoever was wearing them. Really? Really yeah, there's a certain fit for this yes. stuff and if you you're have not to you it, have to be yeah. able to style this shit right yeah. and this is coming from someone who is very basic with his styling 100 percent. i we discussed it before but my style sense comes from rocksteady and bebop from ninja turtles so like that's why we were so apt to to do that promo yeah, exactly yeah. we'll probably bring that concept back again Yes. Like some other iteration I mean, we can of it. Ninja Turtles too, right? I mean, why yeah. not, man? Leonardo, what I up? I want to be Master Splinter, son. No, Donatello. I'm sorry. I like the smart one. Donatello, yeah. I like the smart Apparently, one with the big stick. I'm the dumbass. Yeah. <laughs> Who do you want to be? No, I, I. you said you're out of two of us, you're the smart one. No, no, no. no. That's not that how is. it is. Yeah. No, no, no. He's not going to let me. It's not, it's not like that. No, but he was like uh, the guy who like invented shit and like yeah, had a, he had a big stick. Guy. See, I was thinking, I was thinking Frankie was Donatello. I didn't know we were including Frankie in the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle I mean, idea. When I when I think about a little, I mean, it, that's, that's not that's very fair. Donatello of him to thinking, be like what? I was thinking you were more of a Leo. That's the first thing I said accidentally, but I don't like the double swords. You're Donatello. He's Leonardo. I'm Raph. I didn't know we were trying to do this accurately. And, and you're, you're fucking trying to Nolan do this. is uh, Mike, Michelangelo. Michelangelo, for yeah. sure. Yeah, but definitely I know. That's, that's what we just said. Right. Yeah, yeah. yeah. He said it disappointedly. He, yeah, he weird. said it. Yeah. But he also said it in a voice that I'm pretty sure he was going to end the sentence with Cowabunga. <laughs> <laughs> he did, act, we did catch, not catch him, like he was reading fucking uh, Turtles and uh, Power Rangers uh, the other night. After the show, so you know. Uh, next, next, next. Oh, okay. oh, yeah. Now I've seen these for sale. I, I mean, I want the the orange. I haven't seen leper. these here. No, I haven't seen. I've these. seen the other two. Yeah, leper but one. But not the not the tiger. And uh, not my size either. That's been frustrating. The sizing. Sizing. The old man scoop over here. Say what? Um, yo, sizing has been fluctuating, you said? No, like, you, you're, like, get excited because you find the pair that you wanted, and it's like, that is a nine. Not, yeah. yeah. If it's the right price. And some people don't have the sizes out, so you got to ask. And, sure. like, I feel like I'm a pretty good judge of sizes yeah. and stuff. But, like, yeah. it, it, I've been so wrong this time. It, it is. It's, it's Size nine. I think it's, it's tough fucking sometimes because, like, like uh, it's got to be the right size. It's got to be the right price, and it's got to be the right interaction. Uh, I will say I might pop back over to a booth I stopped by yesterday. They had some uh, mildly worn Pure Money 3s, size 11, for like 200. Okay. Uh, it's respectable. And like the thing is, like, yeah, dead stock would be nice, but would it? Because with an older shoe like that, a few wears on them is yep. going to extend the life of that. Uh -huh. If you buy a dead stock pair now, like, you're kind of taking a chance. Yeah, I was laying in bed this morning trying to teach Jin that. She will not wear her anniversary ones. Gotta she just do won't it. do it. You got to fucking wear them. Mm -hmm. Like, it will ease into the, pla you know, the foam and the rubber. And, like, you just got to work Absolutely. it in. And, like, don't let it just sit there and just solidify. If she doesn't want to wear them, tell her to just put them on in the house. And just sit in them with her feet up, and that way the, at least the materials were shaped to her foot. I, I like know. that. Yeah, we're wrong with that. We're wrong with that. Uh, this is the pair that I think I like best. Is the, I'm calling them the giraffe. Yeah. Not the cow. Pony. I mean, it's all really, pony. But I'm assuming. I just think it's funny to call them cows. 
Uh, I would love to chop these down for for a giraffe. These mask. would make a fantastic mask. I actually the the giraffe grill art squadron is one of my favorite. Fucking dope piece. Uh, the leopard with the orange. Th this is what I've seen the most of. Yeah, yeah. But these are the ones that I'd wear the most, I think. I think so. I think so too. Um, a little something else. Shout out to Salehi. Uh, this, if it, this is at a technically falls under 2019. Well, this particular so. one, right? Yes. This, yeah, 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 exactly. Yeah, this okay. this yeah. concepts collab. I I forgot this was a concepts thing. Yeah. Dude, we've been. I don't want to go off base with the whole concept thing we were talking about the other the night. Uh, uh, Birkenstock is what they, who they it, just uh, fucked they with just and did like dude, that, there's club. that little clog slide looks amazing. That's who I was thinking of. And I grew I up with everyone in my high school having that. a pair of the brown clog slides. Yeah. They wear all the time, and I, I never that was not I was skate shoe dude at that yeah. point, and I did did not want to wear Birkenstocks. Uh, Shit. But those red ones with the white outsole that we saw PJ Tucker wearing. Yeah. And the walk up, dude, they're amazing. Bet. And these. Are amazing the, too. What, the the Jennifer Lopez. Lopez. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. These are amazing. Such good storytelling. Again, concepts. Except for that weird like, flesh tongue. It's such a perfect name for them. They've really fucking like earned their fucking brand name because they have good concepts behind their shit. Mm -hmm. Like, and I'm forgetting his name right now. I'm blanking. Dion. His name Dion. That's who. So. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Dion Point. I believe so. Yeah. Dion Point. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Uh, he's clearly on point. Like on he point? knows exactly what he's doing with using these certain brands and what he's bringing to the table. Sure. And yeah. it always is fire. Like, when have they had a a wax shoe drop? I don't know. I, I, don't I haven't know. been able to think of one. We did, we were talking about that yesterday. Like, there are pairs that are, like, not for me, but I'm like, it's still fire. Like, I think a lot of people fail to, like, understand, like, the difference between... Like, you gotta, you, of course, we're gonna have our opinions, and we have our, our pretty strong opinions on the show all the time. If something's whack, we're gonna tell you it's fucking whack. But sometimes we're like, eh, it's not really whack, it's just not for me. Yeah. But I think that's, that, that's a. No, and I'm very open, open about that. Yeah I, yeah, I can't get into a shoe if I don't, if I, I don't wanna wear it. I'm like, yeah. eh. Eh. Yeah. Eh. Yeah. yeah. You can't, why, why would you wanna like everything? How are your, your uh, how are the uh, third degree burns on your uh, Cortez <laughs> there, bud? I put them on the other day, to, like to try to wear them. They're just not comfortable, man. I have too wide of a foot for Cortez. I literally just bought those so we could light them on fire. Damn. Well, uh, I know this guy who makes artwork out of sneakers. He might be able to do something. Oh with yeah, me. yeah. There we go. Yeah, that could be our first mask. Yeah. I'm down with that. Yeah, that'll be dope. Um. Okay, Frankie's fucking with the sound effects right now. <laughs> and we can't hear him, but he's getting a good laugh, so yeah, maybe you guys are too. <laughs> uh, we already talked about the uh, no days off and the no bad days. The LeBron 8. Uh, oh, one of John my favorites Elliott. for sure. Yeah, this is the pair that you had picked up. And we dyed uh, green for you. Yes, it came out so came well. Out real kind of, nice. Yeah, there's and shades of this skittle that remind me of it. Yeah, but it's it's pretty close to the tones that they used on the other monotone releases of this with the pink and I the beige. I would agree. Like they would definitely look like, good in line. Looks like you got the friends them. and family edition. It definitely gets looks. You got when got I, the I wear it, out. bro. Yeah. As I struggle to put a skittle in my mouth. Part two. Part two. <laughs> Uh, okay, I saw these here. Yeah, I was yeah, just looking really, at them. This really nice woman yesterday was wearing these with this adorable fringe bulldog. Oh, nice. You were there, that dog, with the one that wanted to get that basketball so fucking bad? I did it see that. It was hilarious. He was laser focused. Uh, the uh, the Olivia Kim pack. I would, I would give her, that was a solid collab all around. Is that the one? She also did the footscapes, right? Yes. With, the, with like yes. the zebra stripes yes. on it? Yes. I just saw those walk by not five minutes ago. The Z, it, well, and she also did the pony hair fours, all black pony yeah, hair yeah, fours, all black ones. Um, Super there's solid a pair of Air all Force blacks. ones that was pretty solid, but like, and to have the Air Moab in that motherfucker, like this is, I've been kind of peeping for these. Like that brown doesn't this really do you, it for bro. me. 
but like I'll make that shit work. I guarantee it. No, you need to get these and wear them like Dino's wearing his Hirachis. Right, just into yeah, the ground. Just, no, just like they, have a pair. Of they're like comfy that. as a motherfucker. Yeah, dude. I, I tell you that. But to be honest with you, what Eating I probably all these should. goddamn Skittles. These Skittles are fucking great, man. My tongue is already like, fuck you doing? <laughs> Eating sugar and shit. Uh, what about the uh, the missing link, aka the Susan Air Max ones? Man, this is a beautiful wild pair. This is one that I would never wear, but I love everything about it. And the best part is the stitching on the midsole. Yeah, yeah. Um, I've never seen that done on Air Max One. You mean I like an Air Max either. One? I'm such a fan of that I've. You know what I mean? There's certain shoes where like I've seen every single rendition of that. Yeah. Basically, I mean besides like. With Crazy this pair samples and last longer than your typical Air Max One in that case. I don't think it's really stitched. What's that? It just, oh, it just, it just, just molded. Okay. I think it's it's yeah. Look, I mean, zoom in on that. I don't know, bro. That looks pretty real. That looks real, man. Look, it's crooked. And look, it's crooked. <laughs> That's how you know it's really real. <laughs> There's imperfections. Dude, I definitely thought that was just a, like a feature, like a printed feature. We'll have to uh, take a walk around and see if we can see one of these in person. But there's a lot of details here that, yeah, you can't yeah, get you, from just one Yeah, go out and find a pair slide. of these. We'll cut you your camera like, in a second. Like, look at these fucking kidding, eyelets kidding, up here, bro. It's insane. Frankie's going to try to try to hunt He's a pair down. He's going to go hunt this down. We'll see if he, if he pops up here on my... No, you did not. You found it. Okay, I'm gonna, gonna bring it up. We're gonna bring it is up. Is that the table right now? Frankie has spotted a pair of the missing link in the wild. Yeah, they're right there. See the stitching on the midsole. And here we oh, are. We got a pair. Is. We got a pair. Oh, what size and, uh, is that? You might not be able to pick them up. The guy, the guy might not let him pick them up. Uh, Crystal, will you tell him to go focus on the stitching on the midsole? I can't believe there's a pair right there for it. Yeah, dude, that looks... Here you go. There you go. You can't see what I'm seeing. Oh, there we go. That yeah, looks is pretty that legit. stitching real? I mean, I know that pair is real, but the stitching, is that actually in there? That's pretty, man. Look at that suede. Looks way nicer in person. Yeah, this is convenient. Quite. That corduroy looks nice, plaid, proper. You should just hey, talk Frankie, about everything what this size guy's are table. those? <laughs> you can't hear us right now. <laughs> Nolan, find out what size those are. The shoes that Frankie's holding up. And back to us. Yeah, we're going to find out some If they're 11 or 9 and a half, me or Betsy might end Did up. Did you see a price on them? I did not. 10 and a half. Too small. Yeah. Because my my size 11 Air Max One Nike IDs are a little bit a little bit hard on the feet. What did I win? A Skittle. Hey. Now, <laughs> Frankie wanted to know what he won. That's why I shouted out a Skittle. I forget you're not. We're gonna have to start making you up. I get you a lava or something. Oh, oh Frankie my just God. broke his front toes. Do we have toes. a dentist in the house? Uh. We got an emergency. Is there a dentist in yeah. the house? Be like, fuck that, Skittles. All broke right. your mouth. Uh, <laughs> the Maharishi uh, Dude, the Air Max these are 90s so rare. made from sustainable fabrics and recyclables. This shit is fucking beautiful. Uh, you know I'm a sucker for olive green. I love that they're using sustainable materials and, and, and just repurposing this with stuff. all those details in mind i think it immediately becomes a top 10 air max 90 ever uh, oh of all time yeah but like, I I, this I pair might, is amazing the materials when you i might have to pull the them. trigger if, if if my if my man dano was saying it like that like i can't always tell because i love 90 so case, fucking in my much. opinion 
I know, but like I'm saying, like I'm I'm on that fence line. And I just needed a little push, and I think that statement was a little push. <laughs> I'm a man. Excuse uh -oh. me while I took stock X. Uh oh. Yo, but like it's been like that this weekend. Uh, yeah. Look, son, I'm just hoping that they came down in price a little bit, a little bit. Like what? Uh, oh, how Molly got a beer? What's going on right now? Maha I better Rishi. be iced tea or something. Oh, Lord have mercy. The lowest ask for my size is $3,942. I'm sorry, what? For what the, the Maha Rishi are we talking about over here, Frankie? Air Max 90. Yeah. Yeah, used cars. <laughs> so uh, you could either get a used Golf or a used Civic, or you can get these 90s. Wait, turn um, this around, turn this around. Yeah, I, I didn't hear you. I, I was like, you I didn't, didn't hear even that hear right. the four yeah, What are you talking about? This is easy two prices, bro. Yeah, well, this they, is easy two prices. Top 10. Um, but there are other sizes at a more reasonable price. Much more reasonable price. And, uh, you know, you just got to wait it out. And that's not the only seller out there. So I'm also distracted because I'd much rather go ahead and order. Uh, yeah, I wish we could have your phone plugged into get that. Get the Air Max 90 Bacons for $1,200. $1,200. Yeah, and then I've you pay the, the pay Back for in the, the day, you could get those for like 600 tops. Man, I'm telling you, bro. But, yeah, so, you know. I'm, I'm going to keep hunting that pair that's reasonably priced. We already talked about the Travis Scott Sixes, man, so I think we are on to, yeah, we're on to the best sneakers of 2019. All right. Some of this, uh, you know, we're trying to not just put up our own opinions on this, try to give you a little bit broader scale and understanding oh, yeah, we gotta of hit, we gotta the, hit the bases. market. And we would be remiss to not acknowledge that the Yeezy 350 has had a huge year. Despite it not yes. coming out originally in 2019, we've seen it for years now. Oh, yeah. The number of colorways and the fact that Ye has made good on his promise that if you want a pair of Yeezys, you will be Dude, getting a pair so, of Yeezys. It is so, so true. You just see them everywhere now. You can, there, if you want a pair, you can have a pair. Which is crazy because the numbers and the availability and, like, it, it's not that hard. You can hit at retail if you if you keep trying. But, like, there's still so many people trying to resell them. That is, there's more of those in this building than anything. I would, right? Or no? What would you say? That and Jordan 1s? Yes. Are we'll the most, talk the more two, about that. I mean, shows. that's pretty much what we're talking about right that, now is, yeah. is the, the biggest shoes but and what so we see the most of. so many easy 350s here. And on foot and, like, right now Agreed. there's two butters walking by together. Agreed. I'm seeing somebody clean their zebras behind you at the Rejuvenator booth. Shout out to the yeah, fam shout over out to at Rejuvenator. Rejuvenator. They've been great neighbors. You as missed always. a hell of a meal, man. I, I really, really go home and shower. I really fucked up because I should have just pulled my phone out, set it up on some type of makeshift tripod, and just filmed it because it was like a fucking aired out episode. I mean, we were smoked, but just yo, the jokes were endless, son. It was quite quite an event. So. Again, thank you, Rejuvenator, for having us out for dinner last night. It was great to link up with you folks. Uh, but, yeah, back to the Yeezy 350s. For me, the clay and the true form. Like, I thought I'd be more drawn to the glow in the dark. That's the, kind of my thing, too. But, uh, yeah, the clay and the true form are pairs that, like, I might still circle back around for. Yeah, I, I, I just wanted to agree that they're now they're everywhere he, yeah. he made true on his promise if you want easies you can have them now and man they're just releasing a lot more now like different colors and variances like these are way different than how they first released even the people would say like what it's the same thing like no there's all these see through panels and like these different <laughs> directions of how things are going i'm sure caesar has been very busy on all this shit word yeah and shout out to him he's part of uh the artist sneakers book which is out yes we have uh the Infinity Mirror, which is, of course, part of our set, but thanks to uh, the artist sneakers, of course, because yes. that's what the Infinity Mirror was put together and for. And, man, it's just a... Uh, everyone stops six photo in front of this shit. And a lot like, of I folks work, don't understand are mirrors or two-way glass. Oh, man. Bruh. Yo. So much confusion. 
Like, it started to smell like turnips. Like, y'all just fell off a motherfucking <laughs> truck. Like, brand new. Like, turnips? bless y'all. Bless y'all. But, like, <laughs> some of y'all are dumber than a box of fucking rocks. Like, no, it's true, get dude. It. Like, yeah, it I, can only trick you for, like, too long. But when you're still standing there five minutes later asking me questions about it, I'm like. Yeah, you sit, you stand here and you deal with a lot of people fu- throughout the day. And it's like, yeah. oh. Yeah. yeah. No, it's a well, mirror you can see. I was like, hey, you should, you should uh, look up Infinity Mirror. Hey, what's up? Oh, you got that third one? I do, but we don't have a... Oh, you're in the seat. They're busy right now. They're busy right so, now. So, uh, other great collabs in uh, 2019. Yeah, I got to say the Sakai, yeah. like all of them, they're the all fucking fantastic. The Waffle Racers I actually like. I you think like those the are sick. See... And, like, I'm really tempted by the blazers because they look so nice, and I do like blazers, but I hate wearing blazers. Like, they're you're pretty uncomfortable, man. Like, I would totally agree. Just I like wearing a pair, pair of trucks. And it's, an like, it's an OG, all respect, dude, but, like, there's new tech for a fucking reason because there's always room for improvement, and we have over the last, what, 30 years? At least? Yeah, at least. I'd say 40 for the 40? blazer. Yeah. You know, I don't know. Be, yeah. Like, but... This is such a fresh take. Um, I, I do like the the racers. I, I Color like combinations both, and all that stuff. I, I'm not a big fan of all the layered stuff, and you know that. Not usually, but like, I think this is this is what somebody with like real understanding like of design. And when I say design, like when you fucking take design in college and they're teaching you color theory yeah. and balance and all of these things that like are boring as fuck to like when you when you go to school because you're like god damn that's what like, people hate I, about I, school yeah, like, like, I got this, this is the Let basics me, yeah. it's like nah like let's go to step 10 sharpen the basics yeah. like you know uh and this is a very strong understanding of I like the double that. tongues a lot. Like I fuck with a lot of the, the things in here that I, I would want on a shoe, but just these aren't. Plus, they they were just that popular where they sold out and were so what, expensive. What pair would be your Those pick? blue and red ones in the, the middle The blue there. and red? Yeah. Okay, see, I, I yeah. think I'd have to. It'd be a toss-up between the orange swoosh green uh, and yellow or the, the magenta with the... Well, the I guess they're mesh. both. Yeah, yeah exactly. Was, Let yeah, me just yeah, describe yeah, that exactly yeah, the same way. Yeah, so like, either uh, the magenta or the gold up top, man. Yeah. Those would be the colorways uh, that yeah, I go for. I think for. I'd almost want both, dude. They're fire. Oh man. I but not for me. It. I like the I like the white blazers too, though, man. The white blazers are just fresh. All right. I felt like we had a good year for SB Dunks. Now, yes. I think a lot of that is actually an attention to older releases and going back and like some of those pairs that maybe were sitting are now reselling for a lot higher um this year's releases were were pretty strong i thought the panda pigeon was was 2018 but i was looking up i have a really hard time with time i have to agree Uh, with that so yeah i'm the worst person to ask for like stuff i don't remember like a lifetime i can look at like the date on the that piece that i made when it was released yeah at the barracks yeah Better than that, I don't remember. That, that would be your reference point. Uh, the dog walkers. Uh, I'm kind of mad that I slept on it, but I it was it wasn't like ah, I don't want them. It was like I got too much shit going on to go wait in line for this shoe right now. Too much dog shit going on. Oh yeah, literally. But like, yeah, those might have to so end up. You go up back in to my... the panda pigeons for a second. I I still I think want a pair. Really? I I had trouble. I, we you know we got that promo code. Oh, and you had remember, trouble with yeah, the promo mine code. Fucked up. I didn't get my pair. Damn, yeah. dude. Uh, I think the the black pigeons are my favorite. The black, all black ones. Yeah, like, yeah. like, and, and honest, like, obviously, if I was like, oh, what pair is better? Like, you know, it's the original. It has yeah. all the history and story. Oh, but yeah. like, if we're talking just visually, I would be more drawn to the all black pair. I like these panda pigeons because of the newspaper clipping. I do shit. like the I'm newspaper clipping. I like that, that bamboo green. Uh, but I'm not big yeah. on like white and black together. Like I like a white sneaker or a black I would actually sneaker. Like, wear those. I think. I, I don't like. I don't know. Panda, panda throws me off. <laughs> I'm not panda a panda thing. guy. Yeah, it's like, okay. does it? Uh, just nah. It's not not my spirit animal, no bro. No pandas. Uh, the Supremes. 
Uh, I like him. I didn't nice get any. I like the jewel swoosh, the fucking paras. I mean, did John get a pair of those? He got a pair. Of those. John needs a pair if he don't yeah. have it. But yeah, like, I'm pretty sure he's got full control of that now. Yes, he does. Oh, the details on that Halloween one. Those were amazing. Yeah, that was a yeah. fun little, and it was reminiscent of, I've seen a few of these on foot uh, here as well, Re reminiscent of old SB days. So um, that's pretty cool, man. That's pretty cool. Shout out to those. The corduroy joints actually ain't too bad, man. I know you don't like brown kicks. That shit looks like some Newcastle ale or something. Dude, that, that, that's a GR that was fucking fantastic, I would yeah. say. Like, the corduroy and, and what's the, that leather on the... I don't like corduroy, but that's... No, and the way they ran it, pair. like, going forward like that. Yes, I love that, yes. dude. Yes, the vertical, yeah. vertical corduroy. Way to make corduroy look sporty. Yeah. You know what I mean? Exactly. Uh, hey. This is definitely personal pick for uh, me and Dano. Uh, that's what I have on foot right now. And, of course, you see the yeah, black Tokyo center. edition. Now I know why you wore those today. Uh, yeah, I mean, actually, to be honest with you, I got the gray pair, the black Atmos, the multicolor Atmos, both of the grape <laughs> colorways. And, uh, you got the bottom left? I do not have the those habanero awesome. navy. Yeah. The, an, or the, the gray and mint. Those two I would I would check out. I have the the upper arch. I have the left, the top middle, and the top right. There you go. Yeah, I threw those in and there. The, that's and the middle pair. middle. I have two pairs of the middle middle. Yeah. See, I got two pairs of the black. I, I kind of want to. I wish I would have doubled down on the multicolor. Um, They're really great. They're comfortable. So fucking comfortable, man. Like, and and you know. Everyone knows and is tired of hearing me talk. I hope you're not too tired of hearing me talk about Air Max 90s because it ain't going to stop. But No, it's just beginning. It's just Winter beginning. is coming. These rival my, like, I want to have a good day. I want my feet to be happy. These are happy feet shoes, man. And oh, that's yeah. what the fuck These it's all, all about, days. bro. Happy feet shoes, all days. man. Like, Yellow pair of undercover daybreaks. Hey. Bam. Yeah, uh, and there's a pair of your side B's too. That's not side B's. Those are the off-white joints. No, no, no. Off the Air Max 90s. Where? With the pink swoosh right here. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Those are the side B's. Yeah. I forgot to put those on the list for the best. Oh, those weren't a collab. Basement. Uh, the basement. Yeah. yeah. We'll we'll circle yeah. back to okay. that because we. But, but in general, this was an amazing year because I've always yes. wanted this shoe to come back out. Yes. And it came back in spades. And they These did a lot of cool stuff snap. with that. Snap, bro. And, like, I really do hope they, they hold up well. And they seem to take a lot of wear and still look good, even though they're, you know, they're imperfect. They're windbreaker fucking material. Um... Yeah, man. Because I think I think this is a, a pair that will be appreciated later on. Like which one? The one in the middle? Yeah, the yeah. Atmos multicolor and the and the Tokyo release. I think both of those. You know, I don't think they're resell and like motherfuckers is hoping to get retail or a little bit more. But like, I could see those going for like the eight nine hundred dollars in five years. I think I think that's a fucking pair that's ahead of its time. Well, we'll and I see think about people that. Like, I, I'm curious about that. I, I just am glad that they were, I was able to get what I wanted. You know what yeah. I mean? Like, no, no, absolutely. And I'm it not. It feels good for what we think to be like a shoe that is on that level. Sure. To be attainable. You yes. Mean, like right yes. in the beginning. Yes. Uh, that's, I, I'm not interested if it's, if it's not like, if it's such a fucking hustle to get, it, I lose I a know, little interest. It, uh, you know it, cause it, cause it. Yeah, it's just so it's such a blessing you get something so fucking sick yeah. that we're like, oh, I'm gonna well, get two of these. Yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah. exactly. Which is how I feel about these Air Max well, Plus threes. I'm like, Boom. and I say that like not in any with any intent to resell my backup pair later, but like more so just as a barometer of the general community's valuing of the sneaker. That resale price, that's what. It, it, it means to me is that other people like value this like as much as I do 
like and enough that it actually has a regular resale price that you know what i mean like yeah. every sneaker has that like yeah that's about you know 2400 or whatever like fuck me right fuck that oh okay. the 34 is now here. i don't have a lot of uh expertise here but dano's full of it i Frankie mean he is wearing his pair right now that's a fact i know at least two people that have bought this shoe because of your recommendation who is that Molly and uh, there you go and Frankie. Yeah, I know they're both in like eyesight, and I ask you, who yeah, is that? Yeah. Me right now. Uh, yeah, they're. I think they're fantastic. They're so comfortable. I like what they're doing with the colors. God, I wish I could get some PEs. I am gonna get these orange ones, even though there's like the amber five rise other things or something I want before the end of the year. Mm -hmm. So bad. Yeah, that's what about them white soda. teal joints though, bro? Yeah, you lost me with those. Like, that's not, that's not my yeah. look. Yeah. Not feeling them, huh? I mean, I have the ones right below, so I'm like... Fair enough. Hey. The Why Not Zero Point Two. Yeah, I have the Why Not Two. But the, the, the whole... You know what I mean? Like, about all the layered craziness? Like, it's, these are so busy. Really? I mean, we know who put these, a lot of these together. But, like... Yeah. These are so busy to me with it is it's not for me i don't think oh the uh own the chaos i'd say all no most of them on the chaos ones are just like holy shit awesome because they're just that obnoxious you know what yeah I mean? uh but in general like they're, 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 these became too the the see-through and all the numbers and stuff it became a little off whitey you know what i mean to okay me. okay i get that off i get that oh. <laughs> lord have mercy uh, fair enough. So you didn't even, you don't feel that these, uh, I mean, we've talked about so many because of the, uh, the PEs. So really oh, I it's wish. because of Kelsey Amy that these are on our best of 2019 list because yeah. we have definitely enjoyed seeing her iterations of, uh, this sneaker for Absolutely. PEs. And of course, thank you again to her right for coming on the show. Those are the mummy ones, right? What's that? Those are the mummy ones, right? Yes, the yeah. mummies are there. Um, I believe that's called Red Orbit right above that. Uh, City Tour on the right above the Own the Chaos. Uh, off the top of my head, I'm drawing blanks on the orange and the teal colorways. And I believe that pink monotone, which I would love, is a uh, women's or a GS release. Dude, pink monotone. All yeah. you. All me, baby. Yeah, yeah. The Nike... Hyper Adapt Hirachi. Um, I have really no personal experience with this shoe. I thought I've, Jason got a pair. I don't think he did. Okay, Maybe I I'm wrong. You said Jason I, got we, a pair. we we saw uh, Staple wearing his at that panel that we did for Clearly the artist sneakers. Fan. Clearly a big fan of that shoe. Um, and I think what's important to talk about these in the scope of 2019 is that is where we're headed. We're going to be seeing new uses of tech and. Uh, what got me excited was their jump from the BB to the Hirachi. Obviously, this isn't a traditional Hirachi. It's, it's a very futuristic uh, imagining of the Hirachi. And I'm really hoping that maybe, maybe, if it would make sense to see a Hyper Adapt Air Max for, like, Air Max Absolutely. Day 2020. Absolutely. If, if they did it to a Hirachi, like... That's yeah, what I'm saying. Gotta, yeah, and so that's what it gets that, my hope up. Please follow through, Nike. Please. Um, so Please. would you say this is like Mark Parker's swan song? Like this is like the last big I'm wild gonna make tech this happen thing, you know before what I mean? I'm like, out. Maybe. maybe. You know what I mean? Like, maybe. Maybe this was that last check mark. Ha <laughs> see what I did there? <laughs> The Kyrie Fives, oh. uh, obviously we've talked a lot about the great collabs. Uh, such a great design uh, sneaker. The Concepts pair is probably my favorite. Dude, that wild engineered mesh on the so upper, dope. dude, it's crazy, the details. Because I have like, the Friends pair, and you don't see a lot of those details like you see in the Concepts pair right there. Now, can they're not even in the Patrick. The Patrick they went with a, a different whole different material. thing there. They wanted it to look like that. No, that, and that makes yeah. sense. But um, 
Dude, so much detail on those that SpongeBob. That is really, Dude, so really much interesting detail. to see the different knit patterns like you just said. I Look can't wait to see my Patrick's in concepts, person because it has that sea foam. Yeah, oh, the like midsole, finish. the yeah. speckle where yeah. it's like a little bit 3D. That yeah, shit is I fucking nuts, bro. Yeah, I can't wait nuts, to bro. see that in person. That shit goes hard. Okay. Oh, wow. We're, we're talking Ooh. about the best of 2019. And what I have to say is kind of a burn, but kind of no fucking surprise. The Air Force One Low and the Jordan One High are the top sneakers of 2019. A lot of that has to do with collabs, but fact of the matter is, is like, that's what folks are wearing again. And it's pretty crazy to me that I, it's not, like, and it is all at the same time, because my favorite sneaker is still from fucking 1990. We're about to celebrate 30 years of that shit. Uh, but like the Air Force One Low was just that shoe oh, that I wore for more than so anything. long. Uh, and I haven't worn in so long because it was just like, I, I feel like I wore them out. You played it out. I played it out for myself. Yeah, yeah. Like I, I did it too hard. I didn't have enough variation. It was, it was just that for so and long. And I'm the opposite where I took forever to come to around to it. To come around to Air Force Ones. I think my first real pair were uh, those Supreme ones, the Supreme camo. Uh, Dino gave those to me. Really? Audio Dino. Damn. Um, gave those to me. And I loved those. But, they, you know, they were stiff and uncomfortable and stuff. But I, then I ID'd a pair of Lunar. Uh, oh, oh. Lunar, lunar Force so, One. Yeah, Lunar Air Force, Force one, one Highs. And they may look like Jordan 1s, yes. like Reds. Yeah. And it's funny because people who don't know any better will be like, oh, nice Jordan 1s. And I'm like, like they're ha, 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 Air Force 1s. Ha, ha, stepped yeah, into bitch. that yeah, shit. Yeah. Uh, I'll be like, wait. Turn your head sideways, like. <laughs> and they're so cool. Lunar those soul? lunar ones, dude. Man, I really wish they'd bring that back into the rotation. Like my uh, Nike ID Solar Yeezy Two inspired '90s are lunar midsole because I, I was trying to mimic the ridges on the back of the Yeezy Two. Yeah. So like, that's such a good fucking look for that. Mm -hmm. That's why they work so well. Yeah, the lunar really works well. I've, I was always a big fan of it. I think someone fucking crop dusted us when they were walking by, bro. You got some I nasty. I definitely just smelled like a tough fart smell. For like well, 30 seconds. Your man Nolan over here, he, uh, he has you're, you're some blaming, gas No, don't blame The Apprentice. I'm just going <laughs> to... That was a perfect smile at that time, dude. That was great. I feel like we got crop dusters. Not, Nolan okay, says okay, it's okay, not okay, by okay. him. He said, so, he said uh, nothing, that was nothing. Right, Goddamn, my mouth was open. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> All right, so yeah, more no, no, go back to the Air Force Ones. We got a lot in there to talk about. Okay, yeah. uh, you picked up the uh, the Coco Snakes. Coco Snakes, still just sitting on those. I'm super excited to have them. Like, those will, those will be worn at the right time. Dude, these clots, are, those are one of the more popular shoes here, for sure. Great. Everyone has, is selling, buying, wearing those. Uh, I would love a pair of either the blue or the black ones. Uh, I have those, what are these, the Chinese <laughs> New Year? <laughs> Sorry. What? Air, Air Force Ones up top. <coughs> the, yes, the Chinese New Year. <laughs> Next to the G Dragon, and uh, I'm I'm fucked up because I am drawing a blank on uh, the artist name who's responsible for the one next to that. I always forget that artist name. Oh, and dude, the what are they? The Paranoids. Air Force Ones top right, like those are yep, everywhere the too. The G Dragon dude. right there. But again, I, I can't wait to dig into my lace box and get some fat laces and put them in some Air Force Ones too. That, that's what I took yep. away from this release. It was like, that ooh, was, yeah, yeah, yeah. some fat ass laces in my Air Force Ones. I was like, Ones. oh, fat laces are back, baby? Yeah. Like, I'm down with that. <coughs> I'm, I'm with it. I am with it. So, any other of these that you want to... I mean, we can go all day on this. Let's just keep going, Let's though. just keep going. Uh, <coughs> the Jordan one, still <laughs> reigning still, supreme. Yeah. Shout out to these dudes over here, though. Off-white 90s and... My man in the vinyl 90s. I saw him earlier. Yeah, you know I. Those are I think so I have two dope. Pairs that of those. like that color midsole is so dope. I can see it from here. I think I doubled down on those. It's just doubled so dope. down on that release, man. Uh, 
Yeah, yeah and we, yeah, I've ones. seen tons of the blue mids. The um, patent fearless joints, seen those quite a bit. Yeah, uh, none Travis of the Scott Jordans that I bought are on everywhere. here. I apologize. It, I, we were trying. We were saying that. No, no, no. It, yeah. What did you pick up this year for Jordan ones? Now that I think about it, well, I think were those pine green ones might be the last ones I got. That was this, that yeah. was uh, October of the year before. Yes. There you go. <laughs> there you go. Now I'm thinking about it though. Did I get a pair? You didn't. You didn't buy no, any Jordan ones Jordan this sixes. year. Yeah. I picked up I'm not the pick Travis Carolina Scotts, and then I sold them. Yeah. Well, good for you. Well, good for you. It was good karma. Sold low and got my Travis Scott sixes, which is what I. I that's my favorite out of even. Yo, I'll say it like this. The Travis Scott 6, I like even better than the friends and family 4 that he did. Like, the purple 4s. The purple 4s are And the purple 4s so are fucking hot goddamn fire lava yeah, fucking shooting out of so, volcano so top, dope. bro. Like, but those olive 6s, man. Nice. No, they're really nice, especially with the yellow lace. Yes, I yeah. have to agree. Yeah. I want to put an infrared lace in the other one. Yes, okay, I can I'm, see that. I'm pretty sure I got a pair somewhere... Unless I've already laced all my infrared laces up, but ah oh, no, I'm tripping. The fucking Atmos uh, Air Max Two Light pack comes with like four, five oh goddamn God, dude, laces, yeah, and I'm pretty so sure there's an infrared in there. You, so how do you good. organize your laces? What's that? How do you organize your laces, your extra laces? They're in a shoe box that... So you don't keep them in the box of the shoe that they came with? Depends on the shoe. I'm the same way. Sometimes I'm like, no, 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 those stay with that. I don't yeah, want that to get confused. Yeah, 100%. Yeah. Uh, but no, I have one shoe box uh, that is to the brim. Like, Yo. you open it and it goes like, it kind of like releases and grows a little bit. Bring your laces. To the next episode okay and i'll bring mine and we'll just fucking go through boxes of laces and trade them like playing cards I, I, yeah i'm fucking down like, yeah yeah you know might have to have a referee <laughs> it's some sort take, of mediation i'll take two of those yeah, fat yeah. laces for one of those no, you only give me one lace. joints <laughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna call up the print shop and be like, yo, I need fat laces with Dano's face printed across <laughs> it. I don't know if you can get a lace that fat. <laughs> but I'm bomb. Uh, All what right. Else you got? Is that the? That's on the end of our slideshow. What's that? That is the yeah. end of our slideshow, no my man. Okay, okay. Well, I thought we had a little bit more. I'm not mean, disappointed. I'm not disappointed. You, you, you're, you're not like, disappointed. Yeah, yeah, that's no, no. perfect, man. That's well-produced show, baby. Yeah, that's, that's good stuff. We're over an hour. We're good to go. Uh, we're going to go outside and have a cigarette. Ooh, this Ravasi Crystal 97. i joint, bro. Right there. I'm going to smoke a joint where I don't have to use Falcor to cover up my habits. What that's were, right. What were you trying to point out? This Ravasi Crystal Air Max 97, the gold ones over there. Hold on, let me uh, we see don't have if Frankie, I can rotate uh, this shit. Uh, have the camera. Whoa, those bapses, baby. Right there, Look at those there, metallic she's bapses. Gone. She's almost gone. Oh, okay. Those are I sick. I saw the, uh, the 97s. Yeah, we could just literally just go like this. I'm kind of all right like, with that. Let me... Uh, well, it's going to live comment on everyone's shoes that's going by right now. We're going to sit here and judge uh, what the LeBron 11s... Not my favorite colorway, but shout out because that's still my favorite LeBron. I don't give a fuck. A nice Air Max ones right yeah. here. The dope. With the, oh, he got those nice, nice man. Yeah, that's some good shit. We got Supreme Fives walking by. Uh, let's see, off white ones. Yeah, not as much not Supreme bad. footwear Yo, as I thought the, I might see. Uh, Hirachis over here with the iridescent tab. Yeah, the Nipsey Hustles. Are those the nips? Yeah. Those were nips? Yeah. I didn't know that was a collab, wouldn't it? Yes, sir. Well, fucking... Yeah, Buzz went and shot that at Undefeated. God bless the dead, man. God bless. What uh, else we got? Some Cortez. I saw the New Balance earlier. Those we got are fucking some, uh, sick. Yeah, the classic Brett Jordan 1s. Fucks with that. 
Uh, some more off-white Air Force Ones. Yeezy 350. Now uh, I can't even hear him, creams. so we're just doing our own commentary about whose shoes are walking Oh, by. yeah, I can't yeah. hear shit that you're saying. I'm just... <laughs> Because we're not talking, talking over to each other anymore. Probably. All right, let's go That's inside a and have pair. a joint. Wait, what pair, of, what pair is that? That black pair right there. I like those, man. Those are fire. No, your shoes. I like your shoes, man. He's like, what's on my shoe? Those are yeah. fire. Those are nice. That camera's crazy. We're uh, thinking about doing a, uh, a 360 camera in an episode, so you could just, like, you decide where you fucking look. Let us know if that's something you want us to do. Yo, that would be lit. I hope you guys want to do that shit. Because we just put a camera shit, right fucking here. And, and then it, they can look wherever right the fuck. Here, and they can just look where they, they want. They get to be the camera in the fucking, that 70s show, Smoker Circle. Yes, and yes, we'll yes, just yes. Fucking, Let me know if that's maybe, something you're into. Maybe we'll uh, put, uh, or maybe when we have two guests, that would be a great chance. So people can just kind of. Like if we don't want to listen to, or like focus on us at all, they're like, look at her. <laughs> Let's look at her. All right, man, I want to go outside and have a cigarette. We're going to end this episode. From SeekerCon. And we'll see you next week with, uh, I think we're going to have uh, your homie from 8 and 9 on. Hi, right, so we're out of here from SneakerCon. We out, motherfucker. See you at the next one.